just kind of wowed me and I was like, whoa. So I checked out his, his actual stuff outside of the band, outside the Jurassic 5, and I just kind of became kind of really mesmerized by just, just the work that he does. He is a really good DJ and a really good producer. He has a very sort of creative imagination. And the garden itself, just to kind of give you an idea of what the track itself is like, it uses uh, like Japanese stringed instruments in, in set juxtaposition with like electric guitar, but just faint, faint string touches and stuff, um, kind of Asian sounds, um, ethnic drums, and then it kind of develops into almost like a sort of free form jazz combination with sort of ambient tones and uh, almost trip hop stuff in there as well. It, it is just a beautiful, beautiful blend and it's just such a well put together record. It's great. My fourth recommendation this week is a track called Reprise and it comes from the band This Will Destroy You who are a post-rock shoegaze kind of band and I've not featured any post-rock or shoegaze stuff yet but I'm surprised because in the last year or two I have really kind of got into that sound into really sort of layered textured sounds and this song is not this song in this band is not going to be for everybody I, I recognize that um, and for a long time it wasn't for me but some from uh, Tunnel Blank, it's one of my favourite of the years so far, but the track reprise is just this really beautiful, ever-growing sense of harmony that's just pushed through these really sombre textures, and just sort of uh, rhythmic drones, and just, it's just really beautifully layered, I mean, if you are patient with music, you can find some amazing I know some people don't particularly like a lot of post-rock or shoegaze stuff because they find it does kind of go on a bit, but, and I can understand that, but for me this song is just, it's just beautiful, it's just so well layered and it just sounds so nice, and the, 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 the group have just done such a good job with that whole album, um, it's a fantastic introduction to that band. stuff it's definitely worth checking out I mean it's worth checking out regardless um, and then you know if you don't like it you, like I said last time you don't have to listen to it again but I would definitely recommend that in fact I am that's why I am saying I'm recommending it because that's what I'm doing that's my fourth track and my fifth track this week my fifth and final one for Monday Mix number five is Long Shot Kick the Bucket by a band called The Pioneers and this is just absolutely unadulterated fun loving reggae at its best it is just summery sensational and just sizzling it's just got such a, such a strong melody running throughout it's so catchy it's so uplifting it's so light it's so fun it's just a great, great track, especially if you're having some sunny weather right now. If you have some sunshine going on in your life today, you want to put that track on, trust me. It will make that sunshine even better. That's what music does. It makes things better. So there you go. And those are my five recommendations for this week. As I said before, each song I've mentioned will be linked in the swimsuit area down below. That's the description box for all of those uh, squares that aren't in the know. And um, check out what you want. Don't check out what you want. And if you like stuff that you've found, which I've found people are, then let me know in the comments. Or if you've got recommendations for me based on stuff that you've heard and you think I might like, then please, 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 let rip. Let me know. Give me your recommendations. I would love that. I'd love to get some kind of forum of conversation going on. So go for it. Go listen. Go enjoy. 